another reason for doing CT is we have a better idea of what we're seeing and we can come up with alternative diagnoses in real time. So here's a patient referred, they have thoracic, that's your mid-back pain. They were referred for a nerd block. What we'll do is we'll actually say, where does it hurt you most? We'll put a little marker on there, we'll scan again. You know what, that nerve is a couple levels off. That doesn't make much sense. Why would I inject that? Right where you put the marker, there's all these degenerative changes here in that costovertebral joint. So how about I just inject that joint? Do an injection, patient does great. And so this is kind of a typical thing. This is the experience of Duke. They just published this last year, and I'd say in our experience as well, probably about quarter to half of the time, we'll change the actual procedure that we do in real time when we do the CT. And the reason for that is we kind of, we correlate our physical exam with the imaging findings in real time.